Hello and welcome back. We just have a couple of jobs to do. I was, yeah, I was going to do the scenes. I thought, mm, it goes against the grain. Well, let's just get cracking. So, yeah, I'm just grabbing the new track, so the little one from the shop, and just a few bits and bobs. So, yeah, I'm just going to send this one up, and I'm going to go and grab that one. Right. Yeah. I keep saying I'm going to show everything, so, yeah. Well, uh, this type of thing is, is really, yeah, this is the sort of thing that people don't particularly like. To like to see, and I don't really blame them if I'm honest, but yeah, it still goes against the grain a little bit. I've got to, yeah, oh, no, did we buy that or did we lease it? Oh, we did lease it. Oh, that's right. Oh, it, I didn't think I'd saved this. This was supposed to be a test, wasn't it? So it saved it. <laughs> Great, so much for a test. Oh dear, right, okay, well let's send this lot back then. This this little test wasn't supposed to be actually here, was it? We're supposed to, so that didn't work so well. Oh, hang on a minute, have I just filled that, haven't I? Yeah, we don't be wasting a lot. Oh. Front loader, so we're going to keep that, the low loader also, yes, for the time being we are. We'll wait for our tractor, because I need to eject that out of that now, and that's if it's coming, or is it, oh. Do they always get stuck there? Oh, no. Uh, now what did you do? Seriously? Do you know, sometimes <laughs> I've got to laugh. I've got to laugh or I'd cry. That's just unbelievable. Oh, yes. This is the last of my normal Let's Plays. Yeah, I did an episode on uh, a really long episode on Western Wilds, the alien gym, and I thoroughly enjoyed it, but it was a monster session, it really was, but yes, we need to check that then. I do like this, we are going to buy one though now, now we know that this works, and I've reminded myself that giant's things don't eject, that was, yeah, that's why the modded ones are the only ones that do. Right, so let's send all of the leased stuff back now, apart from, oh no, that's actually one, so we spray that, let's select and return. Now we need to buy one. We do. So, sprayers. Even if it's, yeah, for, for that money, that is just unbelievable. I have actually got that under Let's Play as my main one. Let's go for colour. No, colour of white. Track with one, wheel brand lizard, and buy. Smash it. Right, let's grab that. Fill up with as much as we can, being as we had to buy that, I don't believe that, that was supposed to be a test. So somehow the game actually did save, or I made the mistake of hitting save afterwards, which was very, very silly, and that was the whole point of the test. Right. Now do we need the roller? We will need the roller, won't we? Yeah, so although I've done... Oh. We will grab the Delva, which is a buy, isn't it? I seem to remember. Yeah. I'm sure, yeah, it is. Otherwise, I would have seen it once I. Yes, wow. And it's the first time I've ever had the Delva on a. It's heavy. Is that because it's damaged? Or is it because it's heavy? Is the question. Now then, can I get in the box? Oh, that was lucky, that's a good job. That is a generous. A generous box. Because, yes, I'm not technically in that, I'm only on the edge. Peter 716, absolutely amazing as for those things. Now I'm worried about our tractor, the uh, yes, the number two, because I've had its bigger brother in another Let's Play and it doesn't like cosplay. Wow, this is really. I 
Now the RX 170 is not liking this. Really isn't. That shouldn't be pulling at 15 kph. Ooh. It is eight tons, so it's the same. Wow! I never realised that monster was. If that's that, how much is the big one? The 140,000 pounds one. You know, sometimes the second I say that, I know. At least this time I remembered it at the beginning. Yeah, yesterday I was on the uh, Alien Gym one and I remembered as we were leaving and I quickly swapped it over to uh, dollars. But yeah, this time at least it was near the beginning. Definitely. Right, now we have got a lot of work to do. We've got a lot of rolling to do. And I hope, I'm sure that we haven't got any growth stages. Sure, we haven't. Yeah, we have done this field, I remember. We missed rolling that. But yeah, that is a shame. That's nearly grown. July, is it? It's it is out since I'm sure we've got those. It's only trouble we're doing so. Oh, no, no. Well, there's no rolling of that. That's definitely no rolling. <laughs> You're not rolling that. Definitely not. Uh, no, it doesn't need rolling. Oh, that's right. No, I just bought it, didn't I? Right, let's just... Let's... Let me try... You know, this is the one bad thing about having lots of Let's Plays. Oh, wow, we have got the silage to shift. Right, let's get that done. Yeah, we need to move the nursing tank out. And we need to shift the silage. That's what, uh, now this is, yeah, we could really do with a bigger trailer, but we really haven't got the money right now to do that. the other day in Edison I thought you just people don't want to hear you moaning all the time. Got literally yeah, just chill. Don't worry about things. Oh, that is absolutely empty actually. Right, let's get cracking. Remember the time lapse this was this is gonna take yeah, it's gonna be at least three and a bit. Now can we No that's not no it's not the right growth stage is it? I think, ah, that's why we, yeah, we stopped the month before so we can get all of our jobs done. Right, that's nice to know actually that we've got the Dalbo for next time. We've got the, uh, have we still got the Mare? We have, we do need to get the Mare too. Absolutely amazing. Yes, I've tried these on Assad quite a lot. I know that we know that they work, but it is, yeah. Oh, this is the bit yet. So this is the only downside to to this. But you've got to, like literally. Right, so I'm going to say my words. We're going to go to a very brief time lapse. While we do this, to process this, yeah, to keep our business model going, and then we should speed time up till tomorrow, where I think we're going to be exceptionally busy doing both the harvest and. Grass and cook to a cutting grass, which is, yeah. yeah. We need this money though, don't we, to do our animals? That much I do remember. Yeah, animals next. That is the plan. Right. Back. Is this a quick back? Not like the lizards, they're terribly slow. I think this is a good back if I remember rightly. It is. 
smashing. Right, I am going to, yeah, we know what we're going to do now. So, I am going to say my words. I'm going to see you guys and gals on the other side. Justified really 41 grand. I usually go for a couple of the uh, mares because they are really nice. But if I'd got, if I cooked, obviously, I think it'd all go well. I'd actually go the giant dial though. But I don't know on this let's play, it seems a bit a tad too big. The 12.5 seems a more. Yeah, we haven't got any monster fields. You could make use of the big one, but in some places I don't think it would even fit. 24 meters, I think. In some of our blazers, so I think it's 1.5 is, yeah. I think a big field thing, the monster would be perfect. But right, so then. Oh, I know what I was going to do. Yeah, I did want to. That's for tomorrow morning. I know. No, I didn't want to detach that one. I wanted to detach that one. as well. Ah uh, yeah, that's that means what was on special today. Right, so let's sleep till morning. We have done everything that we can, at least we've fed our business. We will do the silage and feed it once more in the morning. And should we go at I think seven o'clock. It's gonna be a big day. There's an awful lot of work to do tomorrow. So let's go to sleep. in the day. Yeah, that's, that's going to be dark green, isn't it? Let's have a quick look. Yeah, it is. Ooh, ah. 71 was done the month before. Right, so we have a split. 96,000. I think now that we need to go and get a harvesters. And we need to buy or lease a header, don't we, to test. That's the 550. Right, the Dominator. 
you are completely ready. Let's move this one out of the way. Yeah. Now it's funny, the Dominator, that in FS19 did not work with uh, self-unload on course bay. From Giants actually works exceptionally well with course bay in FS22. So yeah, it's definitely... This one is definitely staying, whereas that new one, even if we lose money for it, I don't, I don't suppose it's that important. I, it is important if you're using course bay to choose things, but if we were, yeah, on this let's play, I actually got rid of it on, well, I'm about to get rid of it on the Alien Gyms map, because obviously we have monster fields, and it is important if you use course play for that particular feature. Now, yeah, you know, I, I, I think a header trailer, even with a Dominator, would have been the right way to go, even though we can technically manage this. That was a bit naughty. Which is no bigger than that. Just raise the roof of that car. Yeah, that that's why a header trailer is needed, really, I think. Yeah. Lessons need to be learned, Mr. Smith. In fact, you know, let's do the right thing. Let's Yeah, let's go get one. Here definitely comes to mind. Yes, I am a bit tired if I'm honest, but I just fancy to go on this, so yeah. Now we may have to employ the go out of range trick for them to disappear ahead of trailer. Let's go. I think it's something can the dumbest one do that little very reasonable one because it's, it is the smallest header that you possibly get. because, yeah, we... Mind you, I don't know what its horsepower range is. Right, so we need header trailer, which is down at the bottom, isn't it? I've got to get into the habit anyway of using this. Yeah, we're going to grab the top liner one. I think it's definitely big enough. Right, let's send that one on its merry way. And yeah, look at that. That's definitely long enough for the... I don't know if it'll do its auto thing, but I would have thought so. It's mainly about size, isn't it? I know it doesn't work if you get the it, if the head is too big, so I can't drag it on. But I have seen the Nardi ones work very well. I've tried those quite a few times now. Right, so then now we need to. Yeah, I know we need to get some depth to let that be a bit. Let's just hopefully let the traffic dissipate. Our engine size of ours. In our is what? What size are you? Two and all. You're not very big. Uh, and. Yeah, oh, I keep forgetting. Left hand side. Let's go and see. Remember what big, how big this can be and if we can even afford it. I think we may be leasing if I'm honest the first time. Let's have a look. Yes, we do. Definitely want. What can we go up to that's reasonable? 10,006, 14, I think this is the... If I remember rightly, I think we went through this ages ago. 14,001. Yeah. That one, that one seems actually that is like the big Mora, isn't it? Right, so that number we do want it as number two. We, 
we can keep it as North American. Standard hitch, engine. Where's as big as we can go? Yeah, we'll keep it as is, as that for now. And we are going to go for. Yeah, that, that we're not going to be able to go for a big header though with that. So, with that in mind, we will go for. No, we want to buy a Lisa header actually, not buy. Uh, I would guess the 8.5 case. And we will lease. Said we can lease, haven't we? Alright, I would say actually that um, I'm not sure whether. Yeah. Actually, yeah, that is a point. I have an ideal opportunity to test this, don't I? To see if it can. So we have it on here. I don't think we're going to buy two header trainers, though, because to be honest, we can manage this one harvest because it's a smaller of the two fields, but just one. But let's try that, that is a definite point. Now, I believe oh, it's typical. Yeah, we're supposed to go through it, aren't you? But there's no way we can. Yeah. I would have thought that little. Isn't that typical? I was talking about this the other day. You would think that that little tiny thing would move out of the way of me. It was wobbling, so I think it was feeling the pull of the force, one could say. Yeah, it's definitely beginning to, to pull it. It's too far away. It's pretty bad, it is actually quite bad. Yeah, you're stuck stuck with me and my awful <laughs> I to apologize. Yes, yeah, some content creators are a little bit better at this. But it's not that they are a little bit better at this, it's that sometimes, yeah, they actually don't show everything on camera, which this I always think you can't take yourself too seriously and sometimes you've got to give people a laugh because trust me, even the big names get this wrong sometimes. No, no, that's not liking that. I don't think Right, let's do this the old fashioned way. I don't think, yeah. I don't think it, I think it's a tad too big. I don't think it's actually right. It will fit though. We can do it, but I think we've got to do it manually. Yeah, you need to have it, so we do need a bigger one for this, but we'll, we'll make do with what we've got. I don't know that that should work, surely that is. No, I think it's on the limit. I reckon, if anything, it's slightly. itself given time. Oh no, that's it. It's got it. It's not happy, but it has got it. Right. But yeah, let's grab the case. Case. Do you know, sometimes, why have I bought a case header for a John Deere harvester? What on earth went in my head at the moment to think that I'd got a case? We haven't got money to burn. I hope it works now. Do you know, seriously? Right, I don't know. I do not know what, in my defence, what went through my head. I like red and green together, it's a good job, but whether it works or not is another matter. how long this takes for the traffic to dissipate. Well this is a good test actually right we know for a fact oh, that's a point. Does it work that if there's still something there or do you need to move the something? In which case 
we're going to have to... Okay, this is a good investigation for us all to know how this works, actually. I think the trap's still going to be there because the objects are still there. No. No, it's starting again. Whoa. There's no way you should be travelling that fast in a village. I was right, though. It did work. It, it did disappear because the traffic was right back to here, so we need to do it again. And then we need to be poised. Right, OK. Let's do that again. Now we know how it works. Right, now the traffic should go because there's no player around. Now, if we are very, very quick... Let's now need to race the traffic. Ah, okay. Well, that's bizarre, because so, some of it did go. So the things near the object... Ah, okay, in that case... That means we do need to reset the header, that's the only way we can get this to work. ready later in the day, because we did do it on the same day, I'm sure we did, or did we do it, did we do it the second day, oh well, ah we did, didn't we, I think, I'm sure that is right, right now then we need to be clever here, double gates, remember that, we just need the first section, right, first of all we need these gates open, Once it's enough. 
do think this is the right header though, I mean size. Laid plans of mice and men. But this is why I like to do it live, because I don't mean it nasty, that this is true to life. It isn't always perfect. I know that. I like it's believable. As human beings, we are not perfect. We do make terrible mistakes, whatever. do make mistakes. Um, isn't that part of life? Crashing into cars and stuff. Yeah, you know, it's not something that you want in some ways, but in another way it's more believable. And that's the entire reason why I did always want to do what no one else does. Because it's believable as you. Oh yeah, I wanted to get up because around. I do like the fact you can actually see the framework on this because it's quite rare the way it all needs to fill it out. No, do I need to fill it for this? Right, first things first, let's try to see if it will let you unload manually. I don't think it will, but you don't know. I want to make it something more different than it needs to be. Ah. sensitive than the... we should see, I might be wrong, it's a bit of a bad angle if I'm honest. no kind of force or anything like that with it at all. No. no there isn't. See me. I wonder if I'm going to get out of this quadrant. Well, first things first, I think you need, we do need space. It makes sense to me. Space. 
the other thing that I am forgetting is, is it? This is the wrong kind of. No, I think, I think it will be that. But it is. It has gone high on this particular one, so it's leaning too heavily forwards. So I don't know that it's anything to do with that. That is very low, though. I don't think it's. I put that on the wrong way around, so that's why. This is going to be, yeah, this is true. Is this what I came again? This is going to work against me. It could be. But will it allow us to nudge that off? Bearing in mind, that's sort of got an, uh, uh, you could say, almost like having straps on it. Will it let us push it off? Well, the answer to that question is definitely yes. You sort of seem to break the force. Let's drag. Oh, no, I don't think we need to. I think we can sort that. Brilliant. So, that's something else we've learned. That is why, I, another reason why I do love to show this type of thing is the fact, oh, it's still quite enough force though. It's good to learn together. It is, truthfully, I think. Right, we're nearly there. Yes. So we've discovered quite a few things. One, that we need to get in the harvest at this side. Two, order the right header. That always helps. Can I? Yes. Which of these are dumb gains? That's the point. If I'd had a 13.7 meter, how on earth would I have got through the double gates? Now then, although it fits on, that doesn't guarantee us this will actually work. I'm still not convinced it's going to get through those games. No, I am right. Okay, right. slightly too big for this. Yeah, it's not turning. Tractor to the rescue is what I think. What was I saying? Two minutes ago. Nearly there. Nearly there. I believe they were my very words. At this rate the other fields will be will have turned. Yes. Still, you don't see this very often. What do you say, people, miss? <laughs> I do agree. I truly do. Yeah, this is... I don't mind showing things like this if they're quick. But, yeah, it's, it's a bit of a... Yeah, we're going to need to get the angle right on this as well. So, it's actually... I'm, I'm glad that we've got the tractor doing this. Right, let's close that. That's probably about right. Then we can pull forwards or so. Is it? Is it? That is a point. It's not going to get through that either. We're going to have to go in the feet. Oh, this is bad. So we're going to damage the crop. 
we are actually. There's no way around this the release because that's got to go through that gate. We know that because we can't get it through. So unfortunately, it's had the damage to what it is going to happen. Yeah, then it's lined up with an angle. Let's see. Yeah, now this is why. Why do you know? This is I inherited this. I didn't. Yeah, I didn't. Yeah, this is why. On a lot of maps, you do get left that bit for going through the gates for your headland and. Does go to show it is probably a good idea because you're only going to waste and stress yourself out about wasting and doing damage and all the rest of it when, when really there was never any chance I was going to do this unless I was using a dominator or something like that. Now we've done this right this time, so why can I not? Oh, it's a silly. it off again. Now that, that's bad because that should work this time. It's way too low for this. Perhaps the nard is a lower or perhaps the header dropped on it wrongly. Okay. Yeah, it's not sitting right, is it? So it really could well be the fact that it's wrong trailer, wrong so, which is actually all my fault. Yeah, it's sort of like hovering like it's, yeah, telekinesis or something. Oh, it's not quite what I was aiming for, but I mean, it will work. I was looking to try to get those. Try that. No, we're going to need to pull the header trader out past it. I don't think it's going to like this because it's half stuck to it still. is the case and this worked quite well together. So let's shoot those gates. Let's get this harvest in the way, finally. I do apologise for the length of time at all, but yeah, it's a set of puzzles. And it needs yeah it does need wow, that is way too now then we're gonna learn the lesson that we definitely did 
when doing this course. We need to have more headlands than... Oh, that's a point. Field center, like this one is. It is indeed. Right, let's... Oh, my mouse has disappeared. Seriously. Do you know? Right, create job. This is the newest course play. I mean new new because the old one did not it was not nice. Yeah, it didn't play nicely. So of course they did a very, very quick upgrade because of the update. We're gonna do three headlands for this. Uh -huh. Right, we've got the right and we have got the right target. Oh, perhaps three is too big. Perhaps it can only do two because of the size. What if it was one? Let's try it once more, then we'll knock it down to two. Okay, that's bizarre. Let's try that once more. From scratch, create job. This could be something that has beaten course play. Right, they're both on this field. And we're going to try multiple tools. No. Oh. Right. Save course 71. 8.5 meters. The other thing is, we know it works at 8.5 meters. This way, points go. Ooh, that is a point. This is where, on any course play, you need to tell it the special. Stop, but I'm going to leave that deactivated. I, I can see why people don't choose that. Right, straw swath and combine self unload is the choice. And whether that listens, this is what proves whether someone is a good or a bad harvester, as in for course play, not. Not a good or bad harvest. Oh, actually, no. Let's leave that for a second. We'll let it do one, one set. Now let's get this. No, do we need that? Really, we do, don't we? I think we're going to just keep the one. Right, let's stick that there. We're going to go. Right, can we sneak past it? Let's try. We'll try the first pass to begin with. I don't want to launch it too much, though. Why am I worried? I could go in the field now. This is true. Yes, I agree. I'm being silly now. Right, let's stick that and let's start filling that. Let's go grab another tractor. Whilst that feels, because it does take a while. It's, although it's only 1,500, so I seems to get the impression it'll probably be doing about now. Right, we're looking for, he's about halfway round, so yeah, we need him to finish that before we go in and that's a point. Yeah, we'll get one more set of this done. Then we're going to take that into the field. It's a lot of juggling, it really is. I do think we need, definitely need a another trailer big ones, the seven of my favourite, so it's two, it would suit this let's play down to the ground. Good. Did I check the sails this morning? That is the question I ask myself. I thought I did. What I'm trying to say, I suppose, is let's have a look. Yeah, we did. Yeah, there is the, the other lizard which would give us another 20 tonner. Seriously, I think we probably need something cumbersome. This is ideal for this type of thing. Well, I suppose now even big. You can do one hit. And if you get the 70 ton or 75 tons is what the silage intake for the day is. But you know, I can cope with five tons under if it means doing it in one hit. So, yeah, we've got to streamline this business, haven't we? And I would say that the half 
this should be probably passed by now. Unless, of course, he snarled up on something. Yes, smash it. So it's always going to clock that. So if we do that there, it shouldn't get in the way. It shouldn't. Famous last words. We've seen how this goes. Oh wow, he's motoring. Smash it. Now then, I don't think we'd be able to do this just while we've got a minute. I don't think these tides are going to work for what I'm going to try to do. But we could push the nursing tank. I want to get the nursing tank on our own. This is the other reason I did keep the big bag winch, which I obviously escaped my attention. So we need to do that. We need to drag it out so we can push it off. Oh, it's not liking that. No loader. Tides, you can see if you look very closely, it has got holes. You can, with a normal spine, actually push those in. You might have to resort to the uh, a different way to do this. You might have to nudge it off, which is like so. Now, yeah, we're gonna have to. Oh, there's no way I'm gonna let the store pick that up. those rare tractors where the yeah, if it sits on one, actually, no, I can't detach it, but let me. Do you know, sometimes it's easy to do it another way. That's part of lateral thinking too. It's knowing when to try something in a different way. Right, that's... to show that this is probably equipped to actually have a much bigger header, which is a good sign. I reckon we can go for the 12 meter. This is going to be a bit of a faff. Just trying to get that long pipe over that little trailer. Somehow I think this is meant for 40 ton plus trailers. Right. Do a bit of clean up while we're over this side as well. Well, it's still doing good, very good. Second, second header. We'll just do that clean up of that. So those two corners on this side. Yeah, we'll take this triangle off at the top here that would be left, and we'll get that other one as well. Last one here, and then we should set it in its own way. So I 
machine. Hopefully now that will work. So we want to get the straw at some point, don't we? Want to be Bailey. Zeta got the uh, from loader. This is the actual one that would go with that. So watch that first. Oh, something up with a little more mass, I think. Now then, I think we'd have to go for the from loader. Physics, think physics. Again, oh yeah, we need a bit more mass. Let's try the trash. The best thing is actually, funnily enough, a front loader. It really is. It's not all about mass, but if you haven't got, yeah, a front loader, being as that front loader stuck on the tractor, I hope we don't need to reset again. I seem to have had a spate of having to reset. I hate it with a passion. I love to try and uh, sort matters out with our own thing. That is so well balanced. I suppose, actually, yeah, that is important. To do that, I think as high as it go, it should give a weird centre of gravity. Then we need to push it in the middle because I hope that this is not. Yeah, it's, it's typically so well balanced. Now the trade is getting in the way. Of course, of course. Murphy's law, it's got. Doesn't help that my visibility is poor because it's so, I am so filthy. Yeah, this tractor's ditched. Let's pull the trailer well out of the way. In fact, do you know what I'm going to do? Pull this over here and I'm going to make a phone call to it. Yes, we've got a lot of little jobs to do. That stone, I'm going to get that stone in the. Uh, I think that's the other reason. Oh no, I did bring it across, didn't I? I can't remember where we dropped it, but. One thing we're going to do is we're going to quickly give the store ring to come and fetch that back once we deal with these two issues. Now then, first of all, let's see if that Jeep the tank does any good. Whether it's definitely for a loader jobby. It's more about I can't quite hit it in the right spot. Yeah, I think actually from loader we saw that. Right, now that I don't know if to hit it on the back, let's try the back first. Well balanced, well balanced. Okay. Let's drop the weights first. Let's make it into well too stable. As well as giving it a lot of weight at the back end. So yeah, that's definitely less stable, it was wobbling then. So we had some tool that away. Let's have a look. I think we're up to something. Do you know, never did I think that we would be that better. Now we can do it ourselves. Now this is where the front loader being on actually is very good because you can sort of nudge it in it and then it will spin. Like that, so it gives it the weight that you need. There you go. You don't always need to reset. Right now, then, let's do job two. Stick that on and let's launch the nursing tank. I still, I'm only halfway there though, I'm still going to need to grab the um, big bag winch or a traditional. Oh, now that I didn't expect. Why did that do that? I really did not expect that. Okay, well. Yes, now that that was not the best of things.
Right, so if they're going to spin me around, they're going to need to do something seriously about that beforehand. Yeah. Wow, who would have thought? So, be careful of these weights. Yeah, that is definitely... Ooh, that's better. If they're in the wrong way, they're going to drag your tractor down. Which is seriously... Yeah. Something to remember. Is it going up? I haven't seen it go up, but then I've not been concentrating. Oh my life. Did it done the field while I've been faffing around? As long as work's been done, that's what I'm worried about. No, is that? I think that's something that would cheat on those two. Let's try that before we give up completely on this. I don't think this will work, but you never know. Sometimes game physics can be your best friend as well as your worst enemy. It's not worth it's worth trying. Let's see. Oh, I didn't realise that we've got weight in this. It did say in the module, don't try to lift it full. Well, we've proved two things. Yes, you can put non-standard spikes into this thing. It doesn't want to let go of said object. It doesn't withdraw them. Wow, that is amazing to know. Well, at least we know we can actually do that now. We need to sort of use the hawking power of this beast to manually nudge that because I've made such a pixie with this. to uh, take me through the rules of physics as well at the same time. <laughs> now that might work, may just about work. No. no. Now then, is that, is that true? Does it have to be on a tank to make this, uh, uh, sorry, uh, it's designed to be on a flatbed, is it the fact that the flatbed needs to be there because it would provide the power through wires and that to make this work, it may well be that that is the case, and quite a believable one. Right, okay, natural thinking Mr Smith, Venus seems to be an episode all about Physics, lateral thinking, and mistakes. I think we ought to do this with the best tool we have got, which is this one. Because we know we can sort of do things. We can nudge it. I don't know how we're going to get it on, though. Well, that's, that is part of the form of this. Thank you. 
need to be started to move. This is definitely true. Now, there's two tricks we can employ. One, stick a trailer behind that to give it more weight. That would work. Oh, we're going to win the uh, shot. That's not so cool. Catch that. So let's do that first. Low loader. Brilliant. Now then, how are we doing across the road? I would say that we're probably done. Let's go and investigate the most important. Ooh, I think we're caught. Seriously? But hovering over the trailer. You. Wally. Right, so. I think I can work out where we should need to go. Did that miss the third header? It looks like the. Yeah, it does look like it has, actually. Looking at that. Yeah, which is weird because it did start. How bizarre. Just make sure I'm right. Yeah, that should finish now. Let's quickly go and carry on with our... Well, at least we've done the important work while faffing around. yesterday on my um, Asada Let's Play, which is coming to a close I'm on my last session, if it's going to be a nuclear, I am. We have got way too much on at the minute to not do it as a nuclear, but yeah, I shall see. I've seriously enjoyed that map, it's absolutely fantastic. Attach that all that quickly. Now then, will that work? That is the question. We need to empty it, then we're all we're home dry. Whew. Wow. So it's got to be on a trailer to basically with the pre miles that it then can connect its engine to the tractor on the front. Right, we should be able now to fix this issue naturally. There you go. But that is why I do like to show everything, because although it was an absolute pig's ear, we did learn a few things. It was, and it's that bad. That's what the fun of this game is, really. Right, we need to uh, let go of those. We should be able to lift this without any kind of problem now at all. So let's take our time and get this, because this is its job now, this trailer. Because we don't use it for bales. I don't think we ever use it for bales.
Oops, it's come out. Yeah, but it's not using non-standard spikes, I would say. So we'll just see if we can scrape it. Basics. It was designed for when game mechanics get you in a quandary. Was it not? So, with that in mind, all we need to do is think outside the box. That is, of course, if I can highlight that precise thing. Mm, there's too much in the way. We can do it. So, we need to isolate. So that's only in the case out of the way. It does not like letting go of that trail. It never has. There's way too much stuff in this field. It's one of those. No. This is going to be difficult to grab the right one. Oh, excuse me, got the sneezes. Ah, lovely, we've got the right one. Now then, that should sort the problem out. And everything is now as it should be. As well as I've got a tick up due to energy. Oh, no, no, we haven't, you Wally. You've got a tick up due to the fact you just dumped 13 tons of digestate. And we will, yeah, let's let's do this job. Not sure how much digestate we've got left in. Extended info. Just see if we've got any more digestive plenty. Okay. So we'll it. Excellent. Yeah. Quite. Although it is a, it was a pig's ear. We did learn a lot. Well, I think we did. I hope that you would agree. You don't see this anywhere else, and I don't know whether you would say. Here with Evans. But I I do stick to my guns. I think that that's it's not just about what I think I would like your opinions, whether that is a total something never to feature again or whether it is something you don't see anywhere else. And it may be something you don't see anywhere else because you don't want to see anywhere else. But I like to see how to get out of problems and, and also you can sometimes figure out how things work together well. At least we don't need to worry about the head of train getting in the way or anything like that now. We just go in the field. And hopefully do this the easy way with double gates. Thank you very much, Peter 716, for saving my bacon with the big gates. So I think if we improve the engine, this would 
definitely do the 12 or maybe even the 13.7. I don't think it would do the new monster one, but yeah. I don't think. It's definitely not the right header though. The header trader is a little too small. Even though it does work. It should be. That's not. That looks about the right elevation for us. Let's try it. Ooh, we can actually get that as well. Just, ooh, he says. No. Because it's the wrong header. It goes above the pickup point for it. Yeah, it does. It goes weird, so we're going to have to knock that off. Right, note to self. Use the right to train the header going forwards. I am going to definitely call this a day in a minute. I, would have, I wanted to get the straw done as well, but you know, we can start doing that next session. Something I've never tried before actually thinking about it now. Then is that a double gate? I think it's a single, isn't it? Onto the. Yeah, it is. Right, let's stick to now, yard then. Ready for tomorrow. One thing we shall do is get all of the digest date out. Now we know that the 8.5 is too small. We could go bigger. It'd be nice if we've got this beast, then why not use this for the big fields? We could use the Dominator. Actually, yeah, that is what I'm going to try. Let's move this out of the way, actually, it's going to get in the way. In fact, we'll leave you on there and we'll grab the RX 170 to carry on with this. Yes, I'm going to try to have two different sized headers on the same field and with a bit of overlap. I think that'll work quite nicely actually. Yeah. Otherwise. Now why are you not showing? Can't be quite right on the a very brief time lapse and then I shall chatter for a couple more minutes I shall just get rid of this digest but it's a few little bits so I'm going to say my words and see you guys and gals on the other side Jobs are good. That's a bit finickety. Yeah, in places it won't act. It said not accepting digest it here when I was well in the yellow chevron. So, yeah, I don't know whether it's the mold or whether there's certain bits of it. I've never seen it with anything else though, so perhaps it's just the nursing tank's a little bit sensitive. Right. So, 145,751. We all, oh, that is the, yeah, before we. Let's. We need two things to be done. One, let's get the grain into the silo that we haven't placed yet. This is true, we're getting a quandary as to where to place that. Well, we need to settle this matter now. Do. Next session we'll pick the straw up. We do 15 tonnes from this one field. That's not bad, it is a small field. Quite pleased with that. There are a 
little tiny. Yeah, they're not probably about six litres in total with those three corners. There's nothing tremendously big. I think the effort of getting the harvester back in this field is going to cost us far more in fuel than uh, yeah, anything else right. So then, yeah. As much as this is, I think actually, if I'm honest, yeah. Weather's here, is this corner, but we do need to do something with it. Look, there is a lot of space there for those little Omatana ones. I think we're going to need to level, though. And I'm going to go for the Omatana multi fruit because space is at an absolute minimum. So we need to sort of like that, it's so low. So it's hovering over the ground. So we need to level. Well, we've covered quite a lot in this. Yeah, landscaping now, then we're going to level. I think level to that, if I'm honest. Try that, it's not a very big footprint. Buildings, silos, and the Omatana, very petite re dovecoat. Yes. It may do something weird that section there. Now we ought to save it in case something goes wrong. I'm always saying this and I never do it. I think we're going to cut the grass next time because I'm going to keep this session for once respectable in size. Instead of monstrous like I usually do. I'm a terror. Right, yeah, we'll be like that. Now then that is I think of getting to it. I think a little bit further. Yeah, let's go down to the ground level. I always find that's the best decider. We need to just make that a gradual build up. Very gradual. Now that yeah, this is we're not gonna worry about that side, I don't think. Oh we have floating chevrons, I hate Oh no, actually this does have floating chevrons anyway. I remember. I did make note of that on the uh so soften. So oh, I'm in the way, of course I'm in the way. I always managed to get in the way. Lane is in the way. Should be, uh, yeah. Right, soften. Landscaping. Soften. to the point of ridiculousness. Yes, correct. Right, in that case, let's go. Let's level it like we did before. We'll take it out a little bit more. I think I'm too worried about losing a bit of my feel, but you know, sometimes... Let's do a slight raise, if I'm honest, just there, and on this edge, a tadge, and then, then we'll soften it. Slope bit. Our target.
clue what I'm doing. Let's go back to Ray's lower. I understand that. I did I did do it once in Hobbaleron quite well actually in, in my defence, but yeah, I've forgotten when you've done it that once and I always tend to think that you don't remember things right then. We will have to plant the very expensive grass. It costs an absolute fortune. Right now we need to soften a tadge. In fact, no, let's try level first. Right, now then, we soften the edge with the smallest softened. That is a small soften. And I think that's about as good as we get it. Let's paint it. In fact, let's, let's put a bit of concrete. That's asphalt. That's concrete. Is it the right? It's a different kind of concrete. There's two stones. So at least it shades it. In fact, yeah, I was thinking about this earlier. As much as it seems terrible, it seems to let's make that a bit bigger. It just saves all that faffing around. It seems to be doing all this. Let's try and get that a little ish. Smushy. There. That's, I'm not sure it's going to look horrible down at ground level. It's a bit severe. It's a bit severe on that edge. Let's take that, soften it a tad more. But I'm a, the only thing I'm afraid of is. Yeah, it's going to go. And that's when it's going to do the chevron thing. Let's, let's have a look. Oh yeah, no, no, I can live with that. Actually, that's not bad at all. It's, I mean, it is quite a lump of concrete, but then it is. We knew the levels were all horrible. The chevrons float naturally, but we can at least see all the chevrons. Smash it. Now let's make use of this. I know it's not going to be perfect, but we can use the concrete to angle ourselves the back nicely. I think we will have just enough space to do this. And the Obviously, it's it's always been wasted part of the thing. So we've made use of that corner. Yes, we've lost a tiny touch of field. We knew we would, but I think that's not too bad, if I'm honest. Yeah, I was originally going to put this one, put the fermenting silo there. It's a shame because this field, of course, is perfect low, but yeah, it is what it is. We want the animals over there now. So right, so that's that. We should grab another set of silage. And then tomorrow we will get all of the grass caught. I'm not going to class this as a field, and I know it's sort of wasteful, but yeah. Mind you, tomorrow's session is going to be monstrous. It is. We've got a lot of work to do. Now then, let's have a look. Let's have a quick look at the field that we sold. 55 and how much is it first? 152 yeah and it has it's been cultivated so it's still not had anything done so we couldn't quite afford it yet to get it back and being as it's got nothing in it there's not much of a rush I think it's something yeah animals first as we said I think I did say that actually on one of the sessions Wow, that's not liking that. I'm struggling a bit. Which you want to thought it should do? 170 horsepower. That's 24 and a half tons. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, we'll fill this. Before next session we'll get cracking on all of the mowing and most importantly 
that the two fields of oats. I don't know whether to actually do it. I reckon we ought to do another session. I think we'll cut the grass next time. And we will do the harvest of the session after. We'll do the straw and the um, mowing, I think, next time. And the baling. So now we're not using the extractor. It's not quite so severe. I right, want more. Sheds, yes. We should have a look at sheds as well, but um, yeah, animals first. And I think we're going to go out pastures. Two of them, as I said, never done that. Keep threatening to do it. Yeah, you know, I said this was going to be a quick session, not monstrous. Just look at the time. I'm not sure that I quite achieve that. This is going to still be a long session. We're, all we've done is. Well, do you know, we've earned a lot of money. Yeah, we, we've carried on with our business model, is the biggest thing we've done. We, we had a lot of faffing around and a lot of incidents this session. An awful lot of incidents. But we conquered. We didn't let any of those incidents get the better of us. And we, yeah, we did very well. I think this will be it, if I'm honest. Let's have a look. Your yeah, 75 tons is its limit. And there we are, we've hit it, smash it. Wow, right, we'll push that back because we're going to want to shift everything out of the way. Right, preparation, I keep saying that, so let's prepare, let's move this monster, let's get everything onto off the grass, this is still a field, so this can go... There's a point, does that get through the gate? Please tell me it does. Oh my life. I'm so glad it's not the double wheel one. Oh, that is the the Yeah, we're going to have to sort of cheat. Sorry about that, that was the only way that I was going to ever get through that, because it was stuck. Whoa, even the little wheels don't probably get through. And this is where a double gate, or a smaller. You see, this is why... <laughs> this is... away and that is to leave that there. Oh no, we can't because we've got to get the header in as well. So no, we're going to have to damage the crop too. Stop God. There's more than one way to skip a cat. We can't do it for and go backwards. It's all I'm going to say on the matter. Lateral thinking. Lateral thinking. Always. Right, now you're too small for that. So let's grab something a little with a tad more mass, is what I'm going to say. But you are useful. You can definitely move the cultivator. Yeah, we're going to stick everything in a bit of an impromptu, in our impromptu yard through the yeah, over there, where we've got the other stuff. Because this is a proper field, even though the field edge has changed, we're going to have to re-record the grass course. It did always cause us trouble though at that top end anyway, so yeah, I think that's probably going to be easy for mowing. And do stuff like that. This seat is fantastic, but it, yeah. Ooh. Is that cultivating the field? No, it's just flattening the grass. Yeah. Nigel, I suppose it is big for it. 
in its defence. It is not really meant for even dragging big things like this. Whoa. Yeah, it doesn't like that at all. It really doesn't like that. So, yeah, let, let's then stop. Yeah, don't carry on and ignore it. Right, RX 170 to the rescue then. I think we're going to leave it here. I think you can obviously see what I'm going to do. As I say, there are some things that are as boring as watching paint dry, and I think moving equipment is definitely one of them. So I'm going to shift this lot next session. We should get on with the mowing. I think we've done everything that we're going to do this session. So I'm going to say thank you very much for watching. I hope you're going to continue with me. Please do leave your comments, because obviously we all do things the way we want to do things. And I, I actually do enjoy showing mistakes sometimes it can go on a little bit too long so yeah let me know what you think whether this is the kind of episode that you're right no we really don't we're not interested in that i like to see i, I do like to see that that's why i've never liked resets so i do think this i think this type of thing is quite interesting because no one else does it i've never seen anybody showing uh, that this is where i've got to be careful i can't remember whether this is but if it's if it is like watching paint dry, then you'd as soon watch the harvester. Like everybody does that we've seen a thousand times before. Please, yeah, let me know. Because it is it's not about what I want, it's about trying to do things that are Ooh, guessed it right. Absolutely brilliant. Right. Delbo. Right, anyway, I said I was going, so, yeah, I am going to say my goodbyes again, and this time I mean it, so, thank you very much for watching, and goodbye for now. Just thought I'd quickly tack this onto that, just to show the environmental score and how well we are doing now with it, yeah. Other than Field 72, and, yeah, the new one, which we've had the least amount of time, the fields we've had for a long time. I don't know what went wrong with 72 though because that one should be yeah oh did we let go of 72 that's a yeah I suppose that does look like it we we got rid of 72 didn't we for a little tiny bit because I had to buy the data again that's bizarre so the ones we worked on the most barring 72 that we let, let go of have actually got a very good environmental score so yes, I'm, so overall it's 67, and that's only because 68 and 72 are sending us low. The rest are quite high. So yeah, we're going to have to work on these. It just seems to be if you sort of keep on clacking away at doing the right thing on your fields in an environmentally friendly way, that that score gradually changes. So you just got to do everything that the fields info basically says, to be honest. So right, yeah, and that is it. I'm not going to waffle on for ages. I just wanted to quickly show that because I didn't highlight that. Hopefully see you next session. I'm going to say goodbye again now.